a different Goodwill today, but it's the same story with the overloaded Christmas shelves. But you know, it's not, it's not necessarily a bad thing because I've been finding some really good stuff. So hello, welcome to Good Great Fabulous. My name is Desiree and my channel is mostly about thrifting, reselling, jewelry, and Goodwills, <laughs> all those things that I enjoy. So this uh, kind of started out as a hobby many years ago. Then it became my main source of income when my son was uh, really little and I was unable to work. Then I took some time off from reselling, you know, probably about maybe three or four years. And last year I just got back into it as a full-time source of income. Look at these, these are cute. So, that's kind of how this channel all came to be. And I am in Las Vegas, and I shop many of the Goodwills in Las Vegas. And I take you guys along with me whenever I can. This is a pretty sage bundle. Oh, I see, it goes in here. Okay. So, that's what's going on today. And this is the other aisle that is also Christmased out. This Goodwill doesn't seem to have as good of Christmas items as the other Goodwill I was in, my normal Goodwill. My quote-unquote normal Goodwill had a ton of vintage, vintage Christmas stuff. And that video is, it might be the video uploaded before this one. <laughs> I know it's uploaded by the time you watch this, but anyway. Um, what else are we looking at? Now I'm, I'm not really specifically looking for Christmas, but you know, it's one of those things where you may as well look since you're here. Look at this Christmas pin. Does he do anything? Does he light up? No, I guess he doesn't. That's too bad. I kind of like that. <laughs> now we are back to our regularly scheduled program. Look at these cute little angels. These are by Russ, but Goodwill wants $6 for one. I don't think so but they're very cute. I'm guessing they're like a collectible. So much interesting stuff. So much interesting stuff. I like the color of this, but I'm guessing it's some type of a serving dish. Our love was written in the stars, the Danbury Mint. I guess you put like a picture or something in there. Look at these interesting masks. I can't remember who I was watching. Was it Karen Lavender Clothesline that said that she buys these mass and that she has really good luck selling these very interesting looks like someone donated their collection of these this one's really big 
All right, somebody is testing something in the electronics, so <laughs> I will check back in. All right, so I saw this interesting glass vase and I did a little Google lens search and it is a Teleflora and it's really pretty. I love the color and, oops, let me move myself out the way. I love the color. The thing is, is this is really heavy. I mean, it is really heavy. Goodwill wants $8. I like it, but um, yeah, I think I'm going to leave this one behind just because I'm trying to really focus on things that I think are going to sell quickly and, you know, stuff that's not so big and bulky to store and to ship. So... Oh, and when I look these up on eBay, they're selling for roughly about $18 to $22. Look at this cute little teapot. So this is $14.99. says it's made in Japan. I'm guessing that this goes to a set, so it's probably missing all the little cups that go to it. But it's really, really pretty but not for $15 at Goodwill. Well, it doesn't look like it's gonna to be too much of anything today. I'm not really seeing too much, but that's okay. You know, this is my third time at Goodwill this week, and I did find some stuff the other two times I went in, so it's okay. It's okay if I don't find anything today. But, you know, since we were nearby, oops, since we were nearby, I decided to come in and take a look. All right, nothing much over here. So this will be my last stop before I check out the bags. And not seeing too much. Not really seeing much of anything. All right. Um, I think this is going to be a really short video. <laughs> a really short. A really short thrift with me, goodwill with me, you know, well, it's almost the end of the month and the end of the week, so this is a Betsy Johnson, but not really a spectacular one. Okay, let me go pay for the couple jewelry pieces that I've got and we'll call it a day.